San Pisan Museum in Riuttava, Kuopio area. Now it's get rain here, and uh, as you see here are wooden wooden roofs in every buildings, but it's not a problem. It's not raining here under under this building, and I show you which machine they use wood chips for roofs, and this, this machine turning with the belt belt, and here is axle and uh, and some some kind of camshaft. And uh, here is this blade, blade with cutting wood chips, and it's still sharp. I think they used used this machine. They still use this machine, but it's not rain inside here. But it's it's not long time when you have to. I think every ten years or something, you have to change those wood chips in the in the roof. And this building roof is redone a few years ago and here is some samples how this are made and and they get gray and soft quite quick maybe they are possible to use 15 years also 20 years maximum then you have to change replace them and this building have new roof made in this summer last summer and as you see some some roofs are need to be replaced quite soon yeah this main building is is uh, from 1852 and it's a typical design of this region region from this area and these store rooms are building from 1890 and this store is how Finnish name is Aitta and there is different different rooms for different goods and it's two floor this is very big usual they don't have big like this in farmhouse and this building of livestock uh, built from 1882 and here is this alley and this side is, is a barn and this side is for for the living animals like a cows and uh, I think pigs and pigs and cows and uh, sheep. And here is only ground floor. This is uh, this are for chickens. And this is definitely for cat. These are for cows. Here are it's water drinking places. These are for 10 cows, this room. And these buildings are for, for the staff who's working here in the farm. Maybe not this first one, but second one. Because these are more like a barn doors, mm. but, but here is maybe room, living rooms. Maybe we can look inside. The servants' outbuildings and, and the upper yard. Yeah, yeah, here are beds. Very low rooms, I cannot stand in here. But here are wood floors, not same like in a, in a livestock building. Yeah, these are very nice buildings. Backyard. Yeah. And of course here is smoke sauna. But this these are about 120 years old. It's not old like a main building. And this building and, and that bed is for the dead persons. This are mortuary, the mortuary building for, for the dead deaths before can bury them 
And here is also a windmill. Let's take a look around this one. Yeah. Let's go see if we can if we can go up here. They are rotten. We have to go quite careful up here. Up the windmill. This windmill is from 1920s. No, this is so much older. The 1920s they replaced this windmill with the electric one. You can look inside. Let's take a yeah. Yeah, here is a big car. Oh, it's too dark. Cannot see anything. This granary is from 1866. And they store storage here. Dress it and clean it corn, but it's not for corn. They spend it a bit wrong here. This is for the rye and, uh, and wheat and something like that. This is cellar. I think this is for storage potato, potato cellar, it's the name. Let's look in. Ah, this is quite big. So I think we cannot see anything inside here. Yeah, it's a big room, very dark room. This might be blacksmith building. It's locked. I think there is tools inside, so we cannot. They don't let us go in. This is also market date 1866. The smithy. They said the smithy blacksmith building. And this is barn. Three, three floors, barn. It's quite big barn, but the roof is broken, so they need to cutting wood new wood chips to to make a new roof there or it's gonna rotten quick soon so it might be four four storage floors so maybe we can take a sneak peek inside the drying barn this is built from 1895 so they prepared new wood chips to to change the roof so I think it's gonna happen soon when they are changed the roof. And what are this last building? Rehu your Rehu Sailia. The fodder barn. The the fodder barn. Mm. It's nailed, the door is nailed, we cannot look inside. So these days they they make them from the concrete but these are made from wood. This building is the machine shed. It's from built around 1900. Let's see what they have inside here. Here are some, some engines. This machine is for cut, cut and splitting woods and they're all running with the belt so they need to use those small engines and here they they do soap and something they sell they talking about in these machines I don't know how it's working yeah. uh, this is shaw for cutting logs to, to lumber and used with the with the steam machine. Yo. Yo. And here is also one machine to cutting cutting wood chips for the roof. Making making this. This farm is like a like a factory. They they make all products they sell. They they don't need to import almost anything. I think about only salt and something like that. Because they make, make everything they sell here. And here is some small engine. So here is this uh, main shaft where they take the power to different engines, different machines. So here need to have lots of people working. Let's go to see the 
steam engine room. Here is this tiny, tiny uh, place how I can go inside here. So here is one of steam engines. Oh, that, yo, here is the hole for the belt where they should take power out. But, but this engine is not complete anymore. So here is no, no wheel where they take the power out, but, but they should take it from somewhere here because there is that hole for the belt. And here is something washing well, I see these are these are that famous wa washboard what at Finland gravel roads are made from this kind of <laughs> washboard. So that's why our, our car is aching if we're driving with this washboard. <laughs> and these pots are for cleaning clothes. And here is one more building and this is laundry hut. Oh. And this building is fishing net hut from 1870s. And uh, here are also boats and uh, and this old old uh, log logwood boats. I don't know what is name. Ruhi, it's in, in Finnish name. And some old boats. And this is very nice place. And there is that uh, machine machine barn and. And and a laundry laundry hut, and it's very nice view of here. And these hooks are for the for the fishing nets, so you can open the net here and uh, clear, clear it here. And uh, you can put the, this boat down to the lake straight from here. What is this building? The small barn for drying grain. These are built after the Finnish wars of late of 30s and early 40s. We're talking about civil war. And here was one more building and that was a fodder store. Another fodder store. We see that one in the in upper. I think we have to find here the wall path. Go back to the car and get continue to our trip. And here have this one old uh, barn house, and these days they use they use this building for some kind of dancings and uh, some Johannes ceremonies for church or something. Johannes, it's not a Christian, but they they use this for some some kind of ceremonies now. Midsummer fest. Midsummer fest, yeah.